Revitalization work at Dease Park is starting to take shape. Construction crews continue to make progress on a multi-use boarded skating rink that will be ready before the winter and could be open for summer activities by the end of next month. Vasilios Bellos brings us an update on the three phases of work set for Dease Park. The boarded rink that is being constructed here at Dees Park will also allow for a number of summer activities like basketball, roller skating and lacrosse, with the ice surface set to be ready for the winter. The hope is that the basketball courts will be ready by the end of August, but more construction on the site will be ongoing. Though if it is safe to do so, the courts may be usable at that time while work continues. Corey Halverson is Thunder Bay's manager of parks and open spaces and says this phase of the project alone creates exciting improvements to Dees Park. You know, having a, a permanent boarded rink with a concrete surface is actually kind of unique uh, and provides a lot of flexibility for programming and use uh, all year round. So just, just this one change here does create a lot of opportunities for activities. The project has three phases with the second expected to begin next year. It includes extending the playground, new lighting, tree planting, and a shade structure. The third phase will see the addition of a small building with change rooms, washrooms, and a skate tying area. The city also has some pending plans for the former Dees pool site just across the street from the park, with heavy interest from the skateboarding community. Halverson says they are still consulting with the local skateboard coalition and area residents about the site and whether or not a skate park would be a good fit. The use of skate facilities in the past number of years has, has gone up, as has all outdoor park uh, uh, use. So I think you know, there is a level of excitement there, but we do want to make sure it's done, done appropriately for the space and, and for the neighborhood. So that's, that's a consultation um, that needs to be completed, essentially. The next phase of the Dees Park Revitalization Project will be the expansion of the playground. Halverson says they are considering funding for it in the 2023 capital budget and could receive help from the province or the feds. Vasilios Bellos, CBT News.